Okay, yet another radiation detection device. This is an ionization chamber, a really sensitive one. It consists of four Darlington transistors, a potentiometer, several resistors, and I took an old 20-year-old pocket-sized uh, DMM to use as my meter, which works really good. Instead of using aluminum foil, I used 80 mesh copper screening. This will allow alpha rays to enter the chamber because if you use aluminum foil, it'll, it's going to block alpha and only allow beta and gamma. I had this old can laying around, which was really easy to solder onto. Uh, the circuitry is underneath this cover that's so tack soldered all the way around. And it runs a long, long time on a 9 volt battery. I think the draws, the current draws like a one and a half milliamps. Pretty much nothing. And it's extremely sensitive. I'm going to turn it on and show you. Let me put it to right there. Alright. Put the battery on. It's going to take one second. Hold it. Okay, you see the level dropping, 0 0.3, 0 0.2, you have to allow it some time to stabilize, maybe two to five minutes, so I'm going to shut this off for a second and we're going to hold off and I'll come back on. Okay, I let it sit for a while to establish some sort of a th threshold here, let the can reach equilibrium. And you can see it's at 5 millivolts, 6. It will fluctuate up and down, maybe 10 or something like that, because there is a screen on the front, and it pretty much lets everything get in there. So you will see fluctuation. But if you put a radioactive source anywhere near the can, you'll know that it's the source causing it, and not just the fluctuation. Because watch, here's a piece of americium. I'm going to go towards the front of the can with it, and watch the reading. There you go. Climbing up 50, 60 millivolts. I'm an inch and three quarters away probably and it's giving a good reading. Now I'm going to go a little closer just a hair now watch. There you go. She's climbing. She's climbing. I'm going to push it a little closer and watch a bar meter go up. See how fast it's climbing right now? I'll move a little closer, this will get strong. The closer you get, of course, the stronger it's going to get. I'll pull back. I'll tell you, it's a very sensitive chamber. I mean, it might not tell you how many counts per minute or how many sieverts or millirentgens and stuff like that, but it'll tell you if there is a source of radiation and if it's weak or strong.